In this lesson, we will learn how to add a blank row in Microsoft Project. This should work for all versions starting from Microsoft 2013 all the way to the most current version of Project. Before we get started, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to this channel, and hit the bell so that you get notifications when I publish a new video. Here we start with a very basic project schedule that has just been converted from a simple list to having a structure. Most of this schedule has a structure with summary tasks and subtasks. But how do you add a blank line or blank row? This can be done simply in two different ways. You first have to identify where you want to add the blank row. Let's say I want to add a blank row after cargo modification. Then I will have to select the task below, which is the task test, this line 18. This is because when we add a blank line, we will need to add above the selected task. So I want the task right here. Now that we have the task selected, we can go ahead and add a blank line. The easiest way is to click on the insert button on your keyboard if you have it. I will click it right now. There you go. We have a blank line. If you don't have an insert button on your keyboard or just want to do it a different way, then the other way to do it is to again select the task you want, a blank line right above it. Here I'll select any line in my schedule. I'll select this line 10. So the next thing we do, we go to task tab. And then here we go over where it is a group insert and go to task and open up the drop down menu. And in here, I click on blank row. And if I hover over it, it says insert blank row in the tooltip. So click on blank row. And there you have it. You have a blank row. That's it. Now you know how to easily add a blank row. If you want to continue learning about Microsoft Project to become a power user, go ahead and like the video, subscribe to my channel, and hit the bell to be notified when the next video is published. In this lesson, you learned how to add a blank row to your schedule in Microsoft Project.